All right. Now we're doing free code camp, JavaScript algorithms and data structures beta. Learn basic JavaScript by building a role playing game. Step 65. All right. So now we're going to update button two dot inner text and button three dot inner text to be assigned the second and third values of the button text array, respectively. All right. So what we're going to do is we will just take this from the semicolon all the way to the L, copy that, we'll drop it off here, and we'll drop it off here. And we'll call this second one, we'll call it one, we'll call this third one two, all right? Whoops, we'll call it two like this, all right? So now let's uh, prove it to ourselves that we know what we're doing. And let's say a locations at zero, because we know, or like not location, we know that location when passed in from go, when uh, passed in from update, uh, pardon me, when passed in from go town, we know it's locations at zero, all right? And then so we'll put this button text at zero after it, all right? And let's take this, copy this stuff right here, and drop it off one, two times like that. And then call this one one and call this one two. So we know that. Okay. <laughs> so we know all that equals that. So we'll come down here and we'll say console.log. And we'll just get all three of these. Uh, let's do an alt. Let's uh, highlight this. Hold down alt. Highlight this. Okay. Give me a second. I didn't do it like this in uh, rehearsal. That's why it's going a little slow. Copy that, throw them all in here, and let's see what happens in the console. Nope. Let's put a comma and then another comma. All right. And we can see we've got go store, go cave, and fight dragon like that. So that's what each one of these equals. All right. So there we go. Let's uh, check the code. Looks good. Actually, let's get rid of this while we're at it. Just because. And submit it. All right, now we're on to step 66, and we'll see you next time.